A big community job fair will be held this week at Northview High School. The job fair is open to the public on Thursday, July 12th. Mike Warren of the Alabama Career Center System has details. It's a Wiregrass job fair doing a collaboration of the career centers from the Troy Career Center, the Dothan Career Center, and the Enterprise Career Center. Two major high schools have played a big role in this, Northview and the Enterprise High School collaborated with the Southeast Alabama Work and with the Dalton Chamber of Commerce. It is open to everyone, not only Fort Rucker. About how many businesses will be taking part in this event? We were going for about 150, and right now we have 144. We're going to have everything from medical production, manufacturing, retail, food, contractual companies that are going to be from out of state as well as in state, even overseas, aviation and everything that supports aviation as far as mechanics and air traffic control and warehouse and trucking, administration, government, homeland security, fish and wildlife, different police departments, state trooper departments, emergency services. It is a wide range and what's really good, we wanted to make sure that we concentrated on everybody. We have a lot of high school students in the Wiregrass who just graduated and many are going to be entering the workforce. We have a lot of college students who just graduated entering the workforce and a lot of soldiers leaving the military entering the workforce and we have a lot of people already here who might be looking for work or might even be underemployed and looking to kind of step up their game into what their skills are. We're just trying to provide for everybody in the area. The hours are from 9 to 1, and we will open the doors at 9 o'clock. All the personnel interested who, who want to come, and they pre-register, when they get to the job fair, they can go right in. If they don't pre-register, then they're going to have to register at the job fair to go in. There are some classes that are going on to help prepare people if they're interested. We have one venue remaining on July 10th. And it will be at Wallace College in Dothan, and it will be at Rain, R-A-N-E, Rain Hall, room 112. And that will be at 10 o'clock in the morning, and we'll have another class at 1 o'clock in the afternoon. When they pre-register, they can go on and look at all the companies that are going to be there, and then go to the companies that they're going to be interested in, and then they can align their resume to those companies, and then prepare to meet those recruiters when they get to the job fair. Every potential employee should have a resume with them, and they can get assistance at any of the career centers. They can come in, and, and we will assist them. We're not looking for a four-page resume at the job fair because time is limited. If the person is going for a manufacturing job, the resume should state everything that that person has done in the manufacturing field. And we kind of go over that in helping somebody prepare one, that they have the interest of the recruiter, that the resume works for itself, and that they hopefully either get hired there or get a call back. I'm Deborah Pearson reporting for Wolf News.